Hi friends, in this video, I'm gonna make a boost converter using UC3843IC which is a BWM controller. So without further ado, let's start this video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon so you can get notifications whenever I upload a new video. These are my other channels, do subscribe them as well. And you can also follow me on Facebook and Instagram. Component list, circuit diagram, everything is in the description below. So these are all the components we are gonna need for this project. First, I'm gonna connect UC3843IC and connect its pin number 5 to ground and its pin number 7 to positive supply. After that, I'm gonna connect a 2 pin terminal block and connect its 1 pin to positive supply and its other pin to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect a 1000 microfarad 50 volt capacitor and connect its positive pin to positive supply and its negative pin to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect a 100k resistor and connect its one pin to pin number 1 of the IC and its other pin to pin number 2 of the IC. After that, I'm gonna connect a 1 nanofarad capacitor and connect its one pin to pin number 1 of the IC and its other pin to pin number 2 of the IC. After that, I'm gonna connect a 1 nanofarad capacitor and connect its one pin to pin number 3 of the IC and its other pin to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect a 1 nanofarad capacitor and connect its one pin to pin number 4 of the IC and its other pin to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect a 10k resistor and connect its one pin to pin number 4 of the IC and its other pin to pin number 8 of the IC. After that, I'm gonna connect the MOSFET. After that, I'm gonna connect a 0.1 ohm 5 watt resistor and connect its one pin to pin number 3 of the MOSFET and its other pin to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect a 470 ohm resistor and connect its one pin to pin number 3 of the MOSFET and its other pin to pin number 3 of the IC. After that, I'm gonna connect a 10k resistor and connect its one pin to pin number 1 of the MOSFET and its other pin to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect a 22 ohm resistor and connect its one pin to pin number 1 of the MOSFET and its other pin to pin number 6 of the IC. After that, I'm gonna connect the inductor and connect its one pin to positive supply and its other pin to pin number 2 of the MOSFET. After that, I'm gonna connect short key diode and connect its both anode to pin number 2 of the MOSFET. After that, I'm gonna connect a 1000 microfarad 50 volt capacitor and connect its positive pin to cathode of the diode and its negative pin to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect a 2 pin terminal block and connect its one pin to cathode of the diode and its other pin to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect a 10k trim pot and connect its center pin to pin number 2 of the IC. After that, I'm gonna connect a 2.2k resistor and connect its one pin to remaining pin of the trim pot and its other pin to ground. After that, I'm gonna connect a 10k resistor and connect its one pin to cathode of the diode after that, I'm gonna connect a 1K resistor and connect its one pin to remaining pin of the 10K resistor and its other pin to remaining pin of the trim pod. So we have completed all the connections. Now let's test the project.
So that's it for today's video. I hope you have enjoyed this video. For more videos like that, stay tuned and I will see you in the next video.